Are you ready to register for classes at Terra State Community College? This short video will show you how to use the Banner Self-Service Portal for registration. The first thing you will do to register for classes is go to the My Terra homepage, click on the links in the green banner along the top of the page. When the links open, go down to External Links and click on Banner Self-Service. The Banner Self-Service login page will open and you will sign in here using your Terra username and password. Once you have successfully logged into Banner, you will choose the Student tab. To begin the registration process, you will click on the registration link. Once you have accessed your Student tab in Banner and clicked the registration link, you're ready to search for classes to add to your schedule. You will go to Look Up Classes choosing this link. It prompts you to choose a term. We'll choose Fall of 2016 from the drop-down menu and hit Submit. Now any classes we look up will be based on the Fall 2016 schedule. You can choose the subject you'd like to search for by clicking on the title in the list. We'll choose Biology for this session and then click Course Search. This brings up a list of all the classes in that subject area. Then you can click on View Sections to select specific available class sections. We'll look at Anatomy and Physiology. We'll view the sections for this class. We'll choose View Sections and it brings up all of the available sections of Anatomy and Physiology 1. So take a look at the list of classes you are offered and find one that best fits your schedule. You can select the course that you'd like by checking the box in front of it and now you're ready to click Register. Once you click on the Register button, the next screen that opens shows that you are web registered. That means you registered for your classes through the online system. To add another class, click on the Class Search button at the bottom and repeat the process. So let's just go through that one more time. If we need an English class, we'll choose English, Course Search, I need uh, English 1020 Introductory College Comp. I'll click View Sections. And I would like an evening class, so I'll choose this last section, which meets from 5 to 7.15. I will click Register. And again, shows as Web Registered for English 1020. An exception that could occur during your registration process is a class that is full but does have a wait list available. You would do the same process as registering for your classes. You would go to your student tab, go to registration, look up classes, and then choose your term and submit. For this particular semester I need a history class so I can choose history and do a course search. I can see from my class lookup that I do have American History 1, History 1050 available and now I can view sections. Normally in this step of the process there would be a box to select in front of this course but this one has a C in front of it which shows if you hover over this that the class is closed. However, you can add yourself to the wait list for this class. First you need to take note of the CRN you need to write that down. It will be needed in the next section. You can click on the register button. Now this is where you would add your CRN. The CRN that you noted before goes in the box and you just hit submit changes. Now you can see that this class is closed but waitlisted. So then you would choose from the action menu here. Choose the waitlisted option and submit changes. You can now see that you are on the wait list for this class. If an opening becomes available, you will receive an email notification via your Terra student email account. It's very important that you check this. You must officially register for this class no later than 24 hours after the receipt of the notification. If you receive the notification less than 24 hours before the first day of the term, you must officially add this class no later than 10 p.m. on the day before the start of the semester. 
To officially register for the class, you would go through the registration steps again using the Add, Withdraw, and Drop option within Banner. If you fail to take action by the date and time indicated in the notification, you will automatically be removed from the waitlist and the seat will be offered to the next student on the waitlist. Also, any registration holds you have on your student account will prevent you from registering for this class. If you wish to cancel your waitlist status for the class at any time, you can click on the Action tab and click the Web, Drop, or Delete. If you wish to cancel that waitlist status, you would just go to the Add, Drop, or Withdraw. You see the waitlist status here. Click on the Action drop-down menu and click the Web, Drop, Delete. And submit changes. To view your complete schedule, you can click on your Student tab, go to Registration, and then you can choose the Student Detail Schedule. This will show you dates, times, the grade mode, credits, instructor, etc. If you prefer to view your schedule in a different format, click on Student tab, go to Registration, and go to Week at a Glance. This will bring up your schedule in a calendar grid format. This has been a short tutorial on how to register for your classes using the Banner Self-Service Portal. If you encounter any errors while registering, or if you need more in-depth help with registration, please contact the Office of Admissions and Academic Advising. Thank you, and enjoy your time here at Terra State Community College. We're glad to have you here.